around the world. Uh, to the beach, y'all. Let's go. All around the world. Y'all know. This is so, so dead. It's going to be a beautiful day of yes, basketball here today, folks. We're not talking about just regular basketball. Nah, We're talking about. What's up? What's up? I'm Kwame Alexander. And I'm Kwame Alexander. We've been on tour, crossing over the United States. Get it? Crossing over? Visiting schools, teachers, students, librarians in Miami, in D.C., Philly, South Carolina. I mean... What's been your favorite, Kwame? From K.A. in New Jersey. Granger and Washington Episcopal, DC Public Library. Great, thanks. Top, top five questions you've been asked, Kwame. 15. Enough to buy size 15 sneakers. Next question. Yeah, why didn't you make a book trailer? Yeah, why didn't you make a book trailer? Uh, I'm a rooster. But people want a trailer? I'll give them a trailer. <laughs> Will you be serious for once? I am being serious. This trailer is owned by my sister, Chris. And these are her two sons, Joshua and Jordan. Hmm. Those names sound pretty familiar. Tell us what the book's about. You wrote that? Nope. Some seventh graders in Illinois at Granger Middle School wrote it. Pretty much sums it up, doesn't it? Great poem. So, this is a book of poetry. Come on, man. We've been through this before, haven't we? It's a novel about basketball and fatherhood and family and friendship. What do people think about your novel? Love it. It's completely amazing. Eighth graders, I have never seen them this quiet ever, except for when they were sitting listening to um, to the crossover. And well, my name is Samaya Stanley Alexander, and if you want to call my mother, seven zero three. You can't tell her number. You can't say her number. <laughs> and then I had some of my fourth and fifth graders were in the back and they were listening and they were really, really, really into the book. Some of them even put it underneath their jacket and were trying to steal it. I don't know if I had told you that, but yes, they were. They kept trying, we need the book, we need the book. Um, I love the crossover. My friend Brian Crandall gave it to me Friday night, uh, kind of late at night by the time I got home. Woke up the next morning, read it in an hour and a half. Uh, had, had quite a reaction to it. Cried for a couple hours. My kids wanted to know what was wrong. Couldn't explain to them that books actually okay. make you cry sometimes. I don't like to read, but you when I heard the book, up. it just made me want to there. read it more. And yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like basketball. So. And? And now I like poetry. Sliding sweet 
Seven foot shot. What a shot. <laughs>